What's up traders? In today's video, I'm going to be talking about my plays for next week. But before I talk about these plays, make sure to subscribe for any future plays. If you guys don't know, last week for Tesla, I announced the play that I was taking. I turned $200 into $400 and it was an amazing play. If you were subscribed, you could have seen the play. So definitely be sure to subscribe if you are new, if you're looking for some small account plays. I have a small account. I will be posting more of these small plays with huge potentials. So if you are interested in these type of plays and my thought process behind it um well first of all continue watching this video because i do explain my thought process with the potential upside for each of these plays and make sure to subscribe for any future videos because i will be posting more thank you guys i got into these plays on thursday i got into the apple play and amazon and on friday i got into facebook now let me break this down but before i need to show you guys the, the monthly graph i started this account with 200 dollars. the extra four dollars is because i got one free stock if you're interested on how you can get one free stock as well make sure you look at the description but anyways guys i ended up playing tesla and i brought my account up to 400 dollars so right now my account is at three at 298 dollars i'm still at 98 dollars above what i was so as long as i don't break below 200 dollars i'm still playing with profits now let me tell you guys about the place for next week first let's start with this facebook it was really cheap i bought it for 11 dollars it's what it cost me and if facebook closes above 270 next week so i'm basically i'm hoping for a huge move i'll get 239 dollars max return uh that, that'd be max profit so if Basically, Facebook closes above 270, as we can see here, or between 270 and 265, I'll make money. But how I'm trying to play this and all the other plays is if this flips up and the market value for it goes to like $30, I will sell out of it and I'll still make a great return on investment. I only spent $11 and I could potentially close it out for 30 bucks if it opens green, if the entire market opens green. And if this increases in price, that's what I'm planning on doing. And if, if it's wrong, why well, only lose $11? Moving on, my next play that I made, I made it on Thursday. And I am down on this one currently $29. But it's going to be the same thing for this one. Saying that Apple will close above $392.5. And if it does, I can make $250 minus $63, which would be around like uh, $187, I think. Yeah, that sounds about right. But if it doesn't, then I only lose $63. At the same time, if Apple is green and it starts to go up to like $380, this will increase in price. Hopefully, if it goes up to like $100 in price, I will just sell out of it. I won't hold through earnings. I'm playing that anticipation. I got it for pretty cheap. It was $63. It did go down to $34. But in my honest opinion, I feel like it does have potential to go back up. As long as Apple opens green, this is this is pretty cheap as well so now let me go to the bigger play the bigger play i have is amazon now i bought this amazon play at around 314 dollars on thursday and amazon did dip to around i bought it on thursday so i got it in around here around like this area for like 314 and it ended up dipping down to like 2986 and then and then the next day it dipped even lower it actually did end up hitting 2896 dollars and it kind of bounced from there so at one point i was down a couple hundred dollars on this play but again guys i'm only playing the hype see i'm only down 70 dollars right now that's nothing i bought two of them for 160 each so that's 320 dollars if one of the contracts can go up to 320 dollars i will close out it i will sell it and i will recoup my initial investment and i'll have another one for free basically that's how i'm trying to play it if not then I'll just play on the run up. That's how I'm trying to play all of these. I'm just going to play the run up. I'm going to play the anticipation, the 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 bullish um, sentiment behind Amazon and behind other stocks. And I would just sell out of it even if I'm making just $200. The max profit on this will be $680 is max profit. But if I can walk away with just like 200 profit, that's still going to be an amazing profit. I will have made a return investment on this and my other two plays, which would only be around $80. Well, I would have paid for it with these, with these profits. But that's how I'm playing them guys just because you buy a debit spread doesn't mean it's going to go to zero that's more than likely not going to happen it will keep up its value through earnings i have just one more week for this but in anticipation for earnings basically amazon needs to close above three thousand one hundred forty five dollars if it does i will make six hundred and eighty dollars from a three hundred and twenty dollar investment that's a risk reward ratio of like two to one so that's an amazing risk reward ratio and 
if we think about it guys if amazon is trading at around three thousand one hundred fifty dollars after they announce earnings i will only lose if the stock goes down i won't lose if it trades sideways and i also won't lose if it goes up hopefully it does go up hopefully it makes all-time highs but i can't guarantee that but again guys i'm playing the anticipation i'm pretty sure that these will bounce back and be even worth more they'll probably be worth around 200 dollars each and i only paid 320 so i'll be making around 80 dollars because they'll be worth 200 each i'll have two so that'd be 400 and i only paid 320 so if i really wanted to i could close out there so yeah i'm just playing the anticipation right that's how i play debit spreads it's much safer you don't have to hold through earnings but if you choose to you certainly can of course if these contracts drop to around 50 bucks each i'll just hold them there's i wouldn't even want to sell them at that point i would just hold them because i'd have two and they're each worth 50 dollars, so that's a hundred dollars but if, the, if amazon does close above 3145 i still have that same potential to make 680 dollars which is still amazing but that's my place for next week guys again i really did really well on tesla i announced this play last week and i ended up selling at the peak here at market open after announced earnings i sold out right here and it was the peak the peak that i could have sold out after that it just completely tumbled and i would have lost my initial investment i did yolo my account i yolo 200 dollars on that play i turned it to 400 dollars Again, guys, I showed that play on this channel. So if you weren't subscribed or if you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. I'm showing you guys my play right now. I'm showing you my thought process behind it. So let me know what you guys think about these plays. Yeah, let me just any questions you have, any type of video you would like me to make. Um, make sure you leave it in the comments below. Again, this is a small YouTube channel. So any question you leave in the comments, I can certainly try my best to help you. But that's been it, guys. Uh, peace.